Hello YouTube! Flashlight Enthusiast here. Today a short video presentation about new XSTAR VX4 charger dedicated for AA battery size, both in terms of charging but also checking their capacity. Let's stay tuned to learn more about this charger. VX4 Visible Mixer comes in a nice attractive standard XSTAR box with nice picture of the charger itself. Uh, marketing action and what battery sizes it can take, but also the information about the first capacity tester for 1.5 volts AA or AAA batteries. On the back you have all possible combinations of batteries you can charge in here as well as input, output, etc. So this is really nice information for you considering purchasing this or other charger. Aside from charger, you get uh, some detailed manual in multi languages, a leaflet about the extra products and all their features. It's quite nice. Type C to Type C charging cable, and last but not least, a wall adapter with Type C output. And in terms of output, we've got around 20 watts max output in. 5 volts, 9 volts and 12 volts output, which is quite nice. The charger presents itself quite well. It is built in good manner, we've got nice quality plastic material that is fire resistance. Everything looks quite clean, we've got this nice display that is also covered by foil in the package. I just wrapped it up. We've got three different physical buttons that the click is quite distinct. And you can definitely feel it. You've got these sliders that go quite smoothly, actually. So definitely good quality here. We've got some cooling fins to make it even safer. And it really looks quite nice. And you've got also all your uh, compatible batteries as well as input and output. And for those of you who are interested, this is a 3 amps charger. However, it all only works in one slot. So if you charge two batteries at the same time, you've got two amps per slot. And in four, in case of four batteries, you've got either one half an amp or a quarter of an amp charging current. And it's for Leon batteries in terms of one and a half volt Leon batteries. It is around half amp on four slots so it doesn't matter if you charge one or, or two or three or four and for 3.2 volts leaf a po4 batteries you've got same as for leon batteries one thing i miss here on this charger is some uh, rubber covers here for these legs so that the charger when it sits it actually slides on the surface so i really miss that kind of rubbery inserts here Let's check how different battery sizes fit inside the VX4 charger. Of course it doesn't have any problems fitting 226650 at the side slots. So 2 or even 421700 cells are not a problem either. This configuration is also quite comfortable for it. And well, that is a surprise. The QB26800 also fits in this charger, if you're asking. So in that case you're not surprised that protected 21700 cell with USB-C charging port is also no problem for the Alpha VX4 charger. As a dedicated AA and AAA batteries it also does not have any problem detecting and charging these. Which might be the case in some chargers where the tension on the spring at this shortest point it's not the highest and the battery does not make proper contact. Not the case here. What I truly adore about this charger is this little thing right here, which is actually a USB-C charging port. No barrel plugs, no type B USB, just pure standard USB-C. You've got a cable, you've got adapter, but you can also use other things that you have at home, which is always nice not to carry multiple cables once you plug it in, the display will lit up and each time you insert the battery, it will automatically detect the type of battery and IMH here and Leon battery here, will display your approximate voltage of the battery as well as charging current that the charger is actually applying to this particular slot. As you can see, we've got four 
simultaneous charging slots at the same time so uh, 150 milliamps for this NIMH batteries around one amp on this protected Ace Beam 21700 and around five half amp for the almost fully charged Keep Power 26650. What I like about this charger is that you can actually dim the display if you are not using this in full brightness. However, make be, be aware that the display will lit up every time you insert the battery and the battery is in charging or you make any button pushes. If you don't use the charger or any other operations, the display will dim up automatically. You can actually switch between different modes so basically as you can see here you can switch between milliamp and per hours charged and current actually applied to the battery here you can change the current from one amp to half an amp to 20 250 milliamp so as you probably know if you use four slots at the same time you have max one amp per slot so basically this is it but you can also change the mode here from charging to gradient feature so this basically checks the capacity of your each of the battery so this is also quite nice to check whether your battery still has enough capacity or is it already a little bit used in terms of different cycles and it's lost capacity over time. This charger also has a unique feature to charging different technology of uh, batteries. However, unfortunately, I don't have any to test them out. Uh, but if you're looking for something like that, this this charger has this, this option to charge and discharge or check the capacity of Leaf APO for batteries. Extra also sent me their own one and a half volts Leon batteries in double A AA and triple A size. So I highly encourage you to check them out because they have a unique built in low voltage indicator. So whenever you put them in the charger, they actually will lit up in green uh, LED here at the plus pole. So this is quite interesting, you know, to have such an indicator. To be completely transparent with you, these batteries are quite great. However, I had a problem with this one sample here because the charger, no matter which one, could not detect this battery and could not start the charging process. So I believe this one might be broken. However, it always happens to some percentage of products. So I wouldn't automatically say these batteries are wrong. They are completely good and have this unique selling proposition about this indicator when the charging is in progress as you can see this indicator will blink green and when the charging has been completed the indicator will actually disappear so it is quite useful if you don't have this nice display saying how when the battery is full then this indicator might be useful overall i found this charger quite useful and simple to use we've got all batteries supported also in terms of length but also different types of batteries from NIMH to Leon batteries to also the new technology Lifo PO4 so if you're looking for something like that this XTAR VX4 will definitely suit your needs the surprising capacity the length of this the slots are even incorporating the 26800 batteries is quite rare but you will remember that the XTAR was the first one on the market to incorporate the single slot charger for such batteries so overall i'm definitely confident that this performance will suit you well and i can recommend the xstar vx4 if you have any questions or personal comments leave them below this video if you would like to check this product i send you to the official extra website when you can check this charger and any other product uh, thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one